Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be here on the Hunter Call of the Wild out here on Hirschfeld and we're going to be doing the European Bison Guide. So this is one of the guides that I've been planning to do for quite some time now. I just haven't actually got around to doing it up until today. So we're not going to waste any time. Let's jump right in. Starting off with their drink time. So the European Bison, they drink from 10 to 1400 as you can see right there. They are a class 9 animal so that's going to give you a few different options on the guns you could use. Today we have with us the 300, the Malmer 7mm, and then the Sarugi LRR 338. All three of these guns are going to cover class 9 and there are a few others here in the game but these three would be the ones that I would suggest that you use but it really just comes down to preference on which one you like the best. But max level is 5 medium, max weight is 920 kg, silver is 63.2, Gold is 181.6, and diamond is 270.4. So common fur types are brown, dark brown, and light brown, and then rare fur types are albino, melanistic, and piebald. So that does it for the information. We're starting things off here at the bottom left-hand corner of the map, this lake is actually really good for the bison. It has five zones on it for me. The closest outpost is the Tichina outpost, I think is how you say that. I swear, some of these outpost names, like especially on Verhanga, are just very hard to pronounce. But yeah, it's a pretty good spot. We were actually over here um, when we um, were doing our Hirschfeld video the other day, so that's why there's some hunting pressure around here right now. But let's see what we have. We have a level 2, 99 to 158. Do we have any other males? The rest of these do look like females, and I think they are that one. Yeah, it's female. So we don't have any other males over there. We got some others coming in. Both of them are females. Then we have a level 3 over there, 143 to 202. Is that a male? No, that's a female. So we have that level 3. He's a decent one. I'm probably going to take him down for sure. And then we have some others over here. I see a male right there. Level 251 to 111. That one's a level 3. 181 to 241. That's actually a really good one. And then this one, 142 to 201. So let's go ahead and let's take some of these down. Let's start with that guy right there. Um, let's go ahead and get this level 3. And then we'll try to get that other level 3 right over there. He's actually giving us a fantastic shot. So just going to move a little bit to our left here to get this guy and we're actually on top of his zone right now so if we end up like moving from this tent go about 200 meters they should spawn in just because when you spawn on a tent like that with it or you spawn on a zone with a tent they won't spawn in on it so let's go ahead and let's get this guy so definitely a decent one let's go for something like that we're going to use the 300 to start things off with here let's get that one he's going to drop pretty quickly 50 to 75 and the 300 is probably overall the best gun to use um the 338 is probably good as well but the 300 is just very consistent it always works out when you need it to and let's go for this guy gonna aim just a bit high since he is pretty far over there gonna go aggressive but that should be good and yeah 50 75 on him as well and where's that level two um he's not really giving me the best of shots but i think i can manage to kind of fit one in just right beside the tree there might as well take him down as well probably ended up blowing out the zone and yeah 50 75 he's gonna drop probably blew the zone out just because there was some hunting pressure already over there um it's it's definitely close but let's head over there and let's get these three bison here's the level two he will be a silver at 118.53 got him in the left scalpula and the left lung so good shot on him um yeah just pretty much right where we aimed um had to kind of fit it just right beside the tree there he really wasn't giving us the best of shots but we may do with what we had so he's just a tiny little guy, nothing crazy whatsoever, but we do have a floater there. Um, he ended up, the level th one of the level threes, ended up going into the water, so we're going to have to wait on him. I was kind of looking around to see if they were going to spawn in over there, but it doesn't look like they're going to. So they do have, I think, yeah, two zones over here, this one, and then this one right here. I'm pretty sure this one is a red deer zone, so it is. So they have two zones over there, but they're just not spawned in right now. Let's go get this other level three. He is laying just somewhere right over there. There he is right there. We'll grab him and then jump over to our tent and grab the level three. That is floating over here's the big level three that went up to 241 for his estimates let's grab him he'll be a gold at 190.91 right lung left lung that actually penetrated into both of the lungs that is pretty cool to see so that was going to drop him very very quickly and then 181 like we said is gold so he's a decent level three for sure really big level three and then we have that one guy over there he ended up floating over there actually is some coming in now so we have a level three 147 to 206 and then that one is a level three 134 to 193 they're not really giving us good shots as you can see so we're just going to jump over i am going to pull our gun out i think we'll get the seven millimeter and see if maybe we can get one like i'm um, really up close because they're going to be like right there on top of the tent we'll see if we can get one like that but i'm not going to worry about it too much if we don't i just want to grab the level three that had floated over there so let's go ahead run out here and let's see what we can do yeah they are already starting to spook off we're not going to get a shot so i'm not going to worry about it let's grab this guy and we'll see what he's going to end up scoring 
So let's jump over here and let's pick him up and let's see. So he will be a gold at 182.73. So just barely a gold level three, but got him in the right lung and the left lung. So some another double lung shot at 315 meters with the 300. So like I said, the 300 is probably overall the best gun for them just with the penetration alone. Um, but really good shot and two decent level threes. We've got a level 3 right there, 121 to 180. There's also a level 2, 12 to 72. Then we're some really small estimates. We're over here on this lake right now. It's actually a really good spot as well. Um, There are European bison zones just kind of scattered all throughout here. Not all of these are going to be European bison zones. You have some fallow through here, but um, a lot of them are European bison. They just go all throughout here. Go up here, I think they kind of stop right here on the right side of the map. And that's kind of where you cut off the map. Like if you cut it in half like right here, they pretty much drink all along the left side, but then they go all through here. All of these are European bison. There are a ton of them. So let's go ahead and let's get that level three down, I think. We won't worry about the level two. He is super small, like we said. So let's get the seven millimeter here. Let's go ahead and take him down. Now, if the level two gives me a clear shot, I will potentially take it like that right there. I'll just go ahead and take it if he's just going to stand there like that. Let's just throw another, I was going to say, let's throw another shot into that guy, but he's decided to turn, so we won't worry about it. They are going to drop, and I get, or maybe we didn't get a good shot on that level three. I think I might have ended up pulling the shot just a bit. As I pulled to the right, I think I might have, but the level two, he's going to slowly drop. Since he's aggressive, hopefully he stays that way. We'll just run over there, and he'll run at us, and we can try to get a broadside shot as he's doing that. So let's get over there. And here he comes, guys. So let's go ahead and take that, and that will be vital. So, yeah, for whatever reason, um, I think I just pulled the shot a little bit to the right. I am curious to see what ended up happening. But he is going to go down there. We're going to have to chase him because he's going to go to the original spot he was shot at, and then he will flip back around and come at us. But he's probably not, yeah, he's not even going to make it there. He is going to go down right here. Let's pick him up and let's see. So. That just didn't even penetrate. Like, it should have been good, honestly. Um, That just did not penetrate. We are using the 7mm. So it's not going to be the strongest gun ever for them. It is a um, good gun. It's a, it goes up to class 9. But it's just not super powerful like the 300 is. But that honestly should have penetrated um, just very, very close. But 165.46. We got a good shot into the right lung that second time. And he's just a little silver level 3. Nothing crazy about him. Let's go get the level 2. Here's the really small level 2. He actually didn't go very far. He's just going to be a silver at 65.75. And we got him in the left lung, and that shot did penetrate. So 63.20 is um, silver. So if he had been about 3 points below there, he would have just been a bronze. Really small level 2. We actually have some others over here in this zone. So we have a level 2, 92, 149. Level 3, 175 to 234. Another level 3, 92, 149, or 49, yeah, 149. So they have the exact same estimates right there, that level 2 and that level 3. I had to do a double take really quickly just to make sure. Let's go for this guy. I mean, he was giving us the best shot, and he still is. So let's use the 338 this time, and let's go ahead and let's get him down here. We'll just go for him. We're not going to worry about the other level 3 or the level 2 or anything like that. So that will be good. Um, should be anyway. Yeah, 50, 75. He is going to start dropping. Let's head over there and let's get him. I think that's another male. No, that's a female. Never mind. Let's go over there and let's get him. I am very curious to see what a great one European bison would actually look like. I know a lot of people have been talking about it since a European bison multi-mount was added into the game. With the last update, we talked about this in our last Hirschfeld video, but I just I don't know what a European bison great one would actually look like. I think it would be really cool though, but I don't know. But I would set up for that grind just because I want to get a diamond at the very least. Because this is one of these species that I do not have diamond for. But here this guy, level three, he's gonna be a gold at 190.83. And we got him in the left lung. So we've had really good success with the level threes today. All three of them that we've took down, I think, have been golds. Except for the other one. Was the other one a gold or was he a silver? I think he was a silver. So um, three out of the four have been golds, which is pretty good. And then, yeah, like we said, gold is 181. So they've been scoring pretty high as well. Let's go to one more spot and then we'll kind of wrap things up after that. We have our first level four of the day here. 198 to 257. This one is a level three, 120 to 179. And then I think that's it for the males. I'm just two males over here. But this little river system, like I said, is actually really good. We talked about it while we were talking about the lake here. But it's really good. The European bison zones just kind of go all throughout here. All the way up to the top and then all around this top side as well. Just really good little area for the bison. Let's get the level four down. We'll just use the 300 once again. And we'll go ahead and go for something like that. So yeah, that is actually going to be perfect. Thought about taking the level 3, but I think we'll just let him live. That was absolutely perfect. I guess it's probably a heart shot if I had to guess, or something like that. Um, I don't imagine it'd be like neck or anything. Let's head over there and we'll find out. 
And finally, here is the level 4, and he will be a gold at 221.04, right lung, heart, and the left lung. So that was, in fact, a heart shot. Fantastic shot on this level 4 bison, and their hearts are actually really big there. Um, probably if you went for like a broadside shot, you probably could penetrate into the heart there. Wouldn't really risk a frontal shot just because there is a lot of skin that would protect it. But yeah, really good shots on him, and like I said, that's pretty much going to do it for today's video. We're going to go ahead and jump to the map guide. I will show you the zones and all that stuff, the hot spots, and all the good stuff. Let's go ahead and jump to it. So here's the European Bison map guide. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. You can see by the red circles that is going to represent the hot spots. Down there, that lake in the bottom left-hand corner is very good, as you saw. And then the middle lake there, so basically the spots we visited today are the hot spots. But then you have the blue stars, which is going to represent like where the zones are. I don't mark every single zone, but it's just to give you a nice general location of where you might have zones. But that's pretty much going to do it for today's video, so I really do hope it was helpful. And if it was, remember to like, subscribe, comment, do all that stuff. Really does help out the channel, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.